Hi friends, today I am here with Italian farfly pasta. That means butterfly pasta, and it's a bow shaped design, beautifully paired with any types of sauce, and that give you a very most flavorful, tasty experience. And this golden color they have used the semolina and whole wheat flour. They have not used in refined flour. This is very healthy option, and the taste is really different from other pastas. So you have to boil it with excess water with some salt, and it will take at least ten minutes. Actually, it's depend on the quantity how much quantity you have taken. You have to cook till it become tender, and low to medium flame you have to cover it and cook it. In between you have to stir it, so it will not stick one by another. just cover it and in this recipe you can also add many veggies that become more healthier immediate you have now it become tender immediate you have to strain the excess water and the stock which i am getting here i am not going to waste it i am going to use in my white sauce because that enhance the flavor of sauce so keep watching and that is very tender and soft another side heat a pan with 1 tablespoon of butter or you can use the olive oil also 2 tablespoon of refined flour and roast it at least for 1 minute on low flame if you want to add raw garlic so first you have to add the garlic and then Uh, refined flour here i am using the garlic powder so now i am adding the garlic powder 1 tablespoon garlic powder if you want to make it more healthier you have to add more veggies according to your choice here i am only using the capsicum just finely chopped one capsicum i am using just saute it for 2 minutes to give my recipe some cheesy and more rich i am adding some processed cheese two cubes in this just here i am grating it and that is completely optional if you want to make it rich you can add otherwise no need to add simple you can make and this stock as black pepper and this is stock i am transferring first it will give thickness to the sauce next i will add the milk in this stage vigorously you have to stir it otherwise it form the lumps very easily it will take hardly 2 minutes time on the high flame you have to cook if require you can adjust the milk if require more is not thick you can add more milk so when it become thick see a small lumps are there just you have to press it and now you can see it's become very thick on this stage i will add some salt and next cheese that give richness to this pasta and children also prefer this cheesy flavor now it is in everything again you have to cook at least for 2 minutes all the cheese melt nicely in the sauce and give it richness so after 2 minutes you have to transfer all the boil pasta in it and this is the best way you can add more veggies so children can have it so that is the healthier option they can eat lot of veggies with pasta so this is a perfect sauce is ready now i will add the pasta in it
all the pasta I have transferred in it and now mix it well and again cook for two minutes. Now you can see the texture of the pasta is very creamy and very cheesy and the taste is really very delicious. It's really mouth watering. You must try this. If you like my recipe, please do like, share and subscribe my channel. Thanks for watching. And now I am going to add more mozzarella cheese in it. Just want to give the pulling effect. So it's become really very rich. And that is optional, it's not compulsory. If you like, you can add. Otherwise, it's not required so much cheese. Not much, very handful of cheese I am spreading. Now my children are waiting. Mama, when it will complete. So within no time, it's ready to serve. And now the texture is yum. Now you can see the pearl. It's ready within no time. Your pasta is ready. If you like my recipes, please do try and share with your friends and family. Thanks for watching. And please try and let me know how do you find it.